I'm not keeping a wall on there, Chief. I mean, could be all right. Keeping my lands. No one can replace Shelly. <laughs> yeah. You just remembered Aaron Jada. Aaron Jada is one of my favorite cards. I've had a I have a couple like tempo decks with Aaron Jada. Slaps every time. <sighs> okay. World Priest, we don't like you. Yeah, there's some really cool blue eye flesh decks around in standard right now. I mean, am I okay with the trade? Probably. Probably, I fear. Blood Flash craps and control so hard. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> you fuck him up. World Priest always has had like dark sided energy to it, you know. Always. Card has always done uh, too many, one too many like unfair things, I feel. Okay. Are you gonna like answer it or no? I'm getting marched. Like, I'd be okay with removing that, but also... Mm, I might get Creature over Cryptic Code. However, Cryptic Code's got the ward cost on it. So that makes it a little bit of a better, like, defender. I think I'll do Cryptic Code instead. Like, the ward 2 seems pretty tricky for them. I hope. Yeah. We do like to see that. Like, I, I love Preacher, but I think uh, we make the right choice like this. I'm going in, man. I'm going in. <laughs> I'm going in, for real. Uh... Yeah, I'm going in. Let's go! <laughs> God, that looks so pretty! Look at the blood letter, how gorgeous. Wow. That was a good purchase. Creature in a coat. Oh shit. Ooh. The way they lost all their life, it's glorious. We love to see it. That's just so pretty. Like, what's it? It's got no rights. All right, blood letter clutches it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. That felt good. That felt really nice. <laughs> you can technically like, it's not the craziest investment, the uh, or like not the craziest prediction to think that blood letters might ri might rise in price because two two piece combo, no matter what your opponent's life total at, is fucking crazy. Um, like, I really like the idea of the nightclubber, but this is too awkward, I think. I, I feel like I got a mullet. What the hell is this? I mean, at least there's a blood letter in there, I guess. So we'll have to vibe. Just one time. Don't have a one drop, please. I'm a star. Oh my god, double like double blood leather though. Like I'm vibing. I think I'll just triumph the Skrelf here. The surveil lands. Are we just gonna like get like countered into oblivion or something? Mm. 
really need you to like go to two power, please. I'll keep that. Probably. Yeah. Just slam and swing. Probably. Probably. We I think I think your best bet sometimes is just like to race poison, but I don't know if we can. They probably still have a lot of like interaction and stuff. Like expensive cards tend to be pretty bad against them because they just bounce your shit, right? Like that's that's the worst thing. Like, I don't know, maybe I should have multi five. I think I should have. I really, I really think I should have multi five. Shit. This is actually like a counter spell that they're considering. Oh, shit, that's really bad. That's not what we wanted to hit. Yeah. I think I got the wrong hand. Anyways, one nightclub off the top. We might be okay. Might be okay. Not no pun intended. I don't know. I fear to march. Oh lord. Oh brother. No. Six poison. Another land. The 22 land curse is striking us again. <laughs> 22 lands, the ultimate cheat code. Mm, don't do it. Don't bounce it. Don't you dare. Or like they might march it and we're also dead. I don't know. It was the last card. I feel like it's gonna be like an obvious win, and for some reason it's gonna like take them like 30 minutes to figure out whether or not this last card actually wins in the game. I don't know. Yo, thanks, Gas. Appreciate that. Ah, shit. Okay, so at least Rule Priest is gone. Problem is, I'm at 8 poison. <laughs> I don't vibe with that, man. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. Um... Alright, so double blood letter is good. I don't have an attack here, though. Like, maybe... Restless Reef with two blood letters can like kill them. I don't know. Like that would be four. Yeah, that might do the trick. I don't know. I gotta obviously like avoid getting clapped by a <laughs> proliferation or something right now. I'm scared. I'm scared. They're 28. Okay, so... Shit. Um, does Restless Reef win? I don't think so. Th these go for like 6 each, so that's combined 12. This is uh also 12, so that's 24. Is it not? Is my math wrong? Siren pump one time, would that change something? 9 plus 6. 15. 8 each. Oh, no, wait. Is it 8 each? No, yeah, it's 8 each. Wait, that, then it's lethal. I think. They don't go for 6, they go for 8, right? 2, 4. 4 to 8. 
faster than I think we have lethal. <laughs> Alright, I don't fucking know. Let's just do it. <laughs> we'll fucking slam it. I don't know. I, what is math anyways? Let's just... I don't know. Fuck it. Fuck it, we ball. Well, we're gonna find out. Fuck around and find out. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess I did the trick. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> this video is brought to you by Ultimate Guard. Ultimate Guard provides you with premium protection for your trading cards, ranging from sleeves, deck boxes, playmats, binders, and more. Ultimate Guard has everything you need to keep your magic cards safe, secure, and stylish. Support the channel and yourself by purchasing your Ultimate Guard products using the link in the description. Okay. No, it's not. This is like, this is why Spotify is annoying to have up, by the way. The second you like don't click out of the window correctly if you minimize the spotify window obs won't register it unless you have like a third monitor up with the thingy like dedicated to it it sucks <laughs> it sucks i have the habit of like just minimizing my windows nah i don't think this is keepable i guess we gotta keep you know the real one your brask it's unfortunate I could try considering here, look for land. Okay. Sharp-eyed rookie! It's gotta be Golgari, I guess. Golgari, uh, just mid, I mean. Of course it's Golgari, but it's mid. Don't know if I'm feeling reckless impulse because I'm casting Jin next turn almost always, I think. Unless I really want to Warcraft, but then I'm casting Warcrafting. This is why I hate like impulse cards, by the way. This is why I'm a true hater of impulse cards, because it's like. Sure, alright. We'll take the land. It really is an AZ land day today, I think. Mm. Prowess with Otter and Belmore. I think that deck is going to get so upgraded with... Um, I think that deck is going to get so incredibly upgraded with OTJ. It's crazy. Um, yeah. Hmm... It's gonna get crazy. Yo, David, what's up? Princess of Digital Cardboard. Oh, yo, I take that. Um, is this where we play Europe? <laughs> I don't know. Probably not yet. Summon Impulse? No, I'm not attacking. I want to like grow this gin first, right? Mm. Like these play with fires are going to be really nice with your brask. At least. Gugari with four mana open can be a kill spell. Yeah, surely not, right? Play demand answers every impulse. I think that wouldn't be a bad choice. I'm actually okay with keeping this, probably. Okay. So, I guess we're in pop-off range soon. I mean, there's not really any payoff for casting multiple spells outside of... We're, like, storming, I guess, outside of the case of the Rensec lab, but... Um... I guess I'm just gonna, like, go in for the win, right? Holy shit, it's a Phyrexian Obliterator! Ayo, scary sight. Wonder why I didn't play it first though, but okay. I'll keep that on top. 
Okay, I think we're popping off now. I think. Okay, so what do we do here? We slam Eurobrask. Oh, holy shit, it tried to like... No, no pain lands. Ah, I guess it's fine either way. Eurobrask. Alright, let's do this. Play with fire. I think we're doing a thing. Uh, I guess... No, I wouldn't have... Well... I guess... I don't know. I think we just win here, though. I guess we just win. I mean, we already have it. Scar your hand, draw two cards. There we go. You know, that's probably like the best things could ever go for us. <laughs> that is probably the best it could ever get. So we take it. Now what? We're up against Obliterator in the colors red and blue. Scary shit. But we can see. We can see. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if there's enough things to counter with Disdainful Stroke and Golgari. I mean, like, we know that they're an Obliterator deck, but the only things that I can really think of is, I guess, Obliterator and Shelly, but... I don't know if that makes it good enough. Yeah, I will keep the Pierces in. I think I'll just go about it like this. Yeah, you could still, like, Tidebind Glissa. Like, why does it have to be a Rest Aspire, dude? I got a mole. Alright, that's fine. I feel like we need to give Eurobras because Eurobras is like the star of the show, but it's also like this hand is not very friendly. I need to keep the frenzies too. I might have to be Eurobras. Feels wrong, but what else am I doing? You're affected by the same mana curse as you. How to get rid of it? Play 18 lands is what I'm doing right now. Seriously. If MTG Arena is screwing you over with lands, just try it. It's like, it saved me all day long. I'm playing 18 lands here. Like, if at, at that point you're killed at the lands anyways, just try it. Like, take out lands and add some spells. Play 18. See if it works. Like, for me, it saves me every time. I just, I don't know why, but it just works. It really just, just works. I don't know if I'm ever solving this case. This is uh, an experience. Is this is where I slam case? Probably. 18 lands, you draw no lands. Play 24 lands, I have three times full mana hands after mulligans. I don't know then. 22? <laughs> you try 22? I don't know. Case seems bad. Yeah, this doesn't seem incredible. Hold on, I'll try 22. We'll get back to you. All right. Good luck, gamer. <laughs> I'm rooting for you. I'm rooting for you. All right. Let's get this party started. Woo, woo, woo. Okay, um, which one do we like better? Rance Resolve. All right, well, at least I'm getting my, uh, my gin back, so got that going for me. Could I have actually flipped this? No, it's instant. Like, you know, okay, anyway, I move. <laughs> I just... I gotta move. I gotta choose peas. At least I got impulses. Yippee. Does that the opponent have to sign a damage many leave for to one each for it? I think Arena does it, but to be sure, you can always go into settings, go to gameplay, and auto assign combat damage. Make sure that's ticked off to make sure that like Arena doesn't screw you over. Better be safe than sorry when it comes to MTG Arena, unfortunately. All 
All right, I guess I'm removing this. Got another bat. Yeah. Okay, so Glissa is going to try to hunt down his case. I don't vibe with that too much. Well, well, well. If it isn't Eurobrask. Yo, I think we gotta try. I think we gotta try. A flipped Eurobrass would actually be really nice against the Glissas. But um, yeah, get Eurobrass to live, that's the question. This deck is a little vulnerable. <laughs> okay. Okay. Mm. The deck's vulnerable, but so are we emotionally. I'm still looking at some of the replies to the, the IV stuff. So far, we're just having more judges, like, we're having more judges being called and more things, uh, more people saying bug. <laughs> so, the answer has not been found yet. All right, well, that was a devastating turn. Rip your brass. You would have loved to remove this Glissa. Oof. All right. Glissa's a good card. Who would have ever thought? Not me. Uh, I want my gin back. But I need to, I need to respect Glissa, right? Like, I gotta. Ooh, Lightning Strike. Okay, I guess I get Jin back. Come. Okay. Pretty sure I have to, like, play it out immediately. I could have read the card, but also it's got time for that. Sentinel! All right. There's some pressure. Oh, that's Shelly. Ooh, that's Shelly. Uh, impulse. This is probably where I play this to block as well. I think. But then again, we get Euro Rask soon, so it's like, do I take just take the four? This your rest could go crazy, could go stupid. Mm. I, I think I'm playing it out for pressure. We could just win next turn with like combat damage and stuff too. And I kind of can block the sentinel with the elemental, so I gotta try. Have we posted molten duplication here yet? Uh, no. Paints a sacrifice of beginning of like create a copy of target artifact or creature control, except it's an artifact in addition to other types. Gains haste until on a turn. What could we do with that? Something with haste. Haste haughty gins. Interesting for like spell stuff. Vein Ripper. <laughs> in a sacrifice deck, actually, though, like. Could be Vein Ripper and Sacrifice. Hold up. Gas. Gas. Could work. I could see it. We do be ripping some veins. Hell yeah. Braids. Kind of works really nicely with Braids. That's true. It could also just be like... It could just be a great card for a Reckless Sacrifice, uh... Bestie, no! Why do you keep removing my shit? I'm offended. <sighs> I 
Like, what am I going to do with this red mana now, though? Cry, I guess? Flip Eurobrask? No, you can't even do that. Um, it could be looking better here. I don't know what we need to win. I don't think this deck is capable of doing 19 damage with Eurobrask. I think maybe you needed a, a way to like double the damage that it does. Maybe this deck needs like O'Hare's. O'Hare turned the pings into four damage. We busy gaming. Yo, thank you for the prime. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Working towards the sub goal, 12 hours of early access. Oh, or uh, at Wells of Thunder Junction, 12 hours long, brews, good vibes. Subscribe for free with Prime, support the channel, make the sub goal happen. Yeah, but what's a flip gonna do? Hopefully, remove Shelly. <laughs> hmm. There we go. Yeah, early access is back. All right, well, well, well. So that at least removes Shelly. Um, mm, 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 No. This is all a little bit awkward. Why, 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 why? Because I can consider and grab Frenzy, but I can't cast Frenzy because now I have to play blue, pay blue. <laughs> Damn. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah, but what's Eurobrask Flip gonna do for me? Do I not just want Eurobrask in play? Because that at least allows me to get faster to kill my opponent. <laughs> like... Uh, if I flip Eurobrask right now, they're just gonna, like, pump up Sentinel and also swing at me with Underdog and... You know. Sure, I'll do it. I'll do it and let's lose. <laughs> let's do it then, chat. Let's fuck around and find out. Let's make this happen. Let's do it. Everybody wants to flip your brask. I'll see it, show you that it will result in a loss. That's okay. Unless the opponent's really stupid, by the way. If they're really dumb, really dumb. If they just swing at us with a like an underdog, we won't survive the pressure, I don't think, but all right. Oh my god. They would just much rather play a Phyrexian Obliterator. You know, a good thing at least is that we can sacrifice the treasures. So that wasn't very heads up of the opponent, I guess. Um, this might actually work out now. We just have to lose our treasures, kind of. I cannot attack. I can't attack. Like if I'm attacking, I'm you no. Know, like obviously they will kill me on the way back. We can. We cannot attack. If they, if I attack and have my Hearth Elemental tap, they will, like, try to buff up Sentinel, put it to five. I'm screwed. I could play with Fire and Underdog, but, you know, we we can't attack here. We just have to rely on the fact that they're going to attack us. 
is kind of the only thing we can do. And we're going to lose the Hearth Elemental here. God, we're so lucky with them, like, whiffing on these Explore Triggers. We really are. We're very fortunate. I mean, the opponent is just trying to have fun with, like, Obliterator, so I don't blame him. Like, if I'm playing an Obliterator deck and I have an opportunity to win the game or play Obliterator, I'm playing Obliterator. Like, <laughs> I don't blame him, for real. I really don't. I don't blame them. Yeah, it's a swing with both. We're gonna have to frenzy the obliterator. Okay, then. So, uh, how are we planning on winning this game? That's the question now, because we're gonna have to sacrifice permanence here. Um, can you do 13 in a single turn when it flips? I don't know. I hope so. So I'm just trying to figure out, like, how do we get there? Um, like, let's have a look at what our cards might be in the top for us. And then a Holy Gaze. And a land. I think we definitely need to keep a land on top, for sure. Red land. I can't, how many spells do I need? I need to cast a lot of spells, man make this happen and i could now nah, land on top is definitely the right the right move i'm thinking like yeah i i think we i think we have to sacrifice the elemental that's where i'm on so i think it's like sacrifice 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 um, you need 10 spells less for damaging because the flip plus three. True. And I'm also going to throw a play with fire to the face. So... I mean, Reef is at least the colors that I need, right? So I think we're doing this. Um, and then we'll throw the play with fire into the face. Like, all the burn spells are really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We might get out of this. Only because they did not apply any pressure to us, but like they just have, they've just ignored the, the underdogs. <laughs> like, thanks, I guess. We'll take it. Uh, what? I don't know. Stone brain called lightning strike. <laughs> I don't know. Stone brain? Question mark? What's going on? Maybe they go for gaze? Why board that in? I don't know. <laughs> lightning strike! <laughs> Stone brain hit lightning strike. All right, Pog. Well, Stone brain doesn't go after... Yeah, it does go after the graveyard, okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Stone brain, dude. Lightning strike. Okay, here we go. You're a rask, win us the game. Oh god, how am I to do this? What? I can't even see my shit. Ah. Okay, I can't even see my shit. Um, wait, I had a... Did I not? Okay, I'll grab the land here. Where the fuck is this? Okay. Get the camera? Alright, now we got red available. Uh, do I just... I might as well start by with, play with fire here. <laughs> play with 
play with fire. Hmm. So we should already have it here. So we can do like, I don't know, like rents resolve or some shit. And then we can flip your brass for three damage. And then we're clean. I mean, we could keep going. Just trying to figure out like, how do we, is there a way to like BM them? But yeah, you could flip your brass and deal three damage. You know, shout out the opponent for not putting any pressure on us with underdogs. <laughs> It worked out. Hey, anyway, this is kind of gas. Is that a gleeful demolition on turn two for me? Ayo. Hey, Thunder Junction on the same plane as Nuke Pet. Nah, it's still in a new new plane. It is like the on the Thunder Junction, right? Or something. That's the plane, I think. Alright, this looks pretty nice. Especially with the War Leader's Call. See if we can keep these uh, bangers up, I guess. This is also a bot. I was uh, for once in my Spotify, like, Discover playlist, just looking for some new songs. While well, I spent, like, hours upon hours fixing my, my bedroom. Are the Walter Eldrin Enchanting Tales cards legal and standard in Alchemy on Arena? No, they are historic legal and timeless legal. Yeah, Omen Path or something. I, or Omen Path? Yeah. I don't know. Is Historic still format? Yeah, I would always... I think Historic is really fun to play. Personally. Definitely more fun than Tamus and Alchemy, in, in my opinion. Spreading Seas would have been cracked. <laughs> yeah, Spreading Seas banned from Historic. Well, the, like, it's just unreal to me. Can't even grasp that. Alright, let's do a war leader's call here. No more lies in a creature deck. Nah, I think they're just playing like Orts uh, Ortsov. Azori's mid range, really. Yeah, I'll, I'll play some timeless metagame challenge. I just, I have not stopped thinking about this deck and how much I want it to work, so. <laughs> I was just like, woke up, fuck, I have to play this Mardu deck. I, I like, you know, randomly like cold sweats in the night. I have to play the Mardu off deck. Cause I just like, like it so much. Which one you better play Reckless Sacrifice Explorer Pioneer. Do you mean between Explorer Pioneer or like on Arena? This is my Roman Empire. Basically, yes. I can't stop thinking about it. Uh, I have a lot of Thunder Junction cards that I'm really excited for. Not between on Arena. Oh, well, there's no Pioneer on Arena or... or so... Or real life. Right, on Arena or real life. Um... Part of me always prefers arena because I just like chilling in my own bed, my own like room. I'm yeah, I'm gonna go to paper pre release for sure. When is it actually? That's a good question. The twelfth or something, isn't it? Next week, yeah, like the 12th question mark. Yeah. How much is at your LGS? Well, in the UK, you get robbed, but I'll probably be in the Netherlands for the pre release, so I imagine. Actually, I don't know where I'll be. I want to try Obnix list so bad here. Feeling a little suspicious, though. Let me try. I'm like two at a giant with somebody in a cowboy class. <laughs> Yeehaw. Okay. 30 pounds? Right, right, like it's robbery. It really is. I think mine charge like 40. It's like, what the fuck? Yeah, I love pre releases. They're great.
they you, you do get the like you do get like robbed at some lgs's though like i understand that they obviously want to make money but damn like fucking like 50 40 pounds is like the equivalent of what like 60 dollars like 60 dollars to play in a pre-release like be real bit ridiculous bestie i will i will keep playing optics list i will Hopefully I can hit a land. That'd be nice. Okay. Look at Ob growing like this, though. What a legend. Dex is like $30, too. It's crazy. I'll just do pricing. Just like packs, you know, the, the usual stuff. Like, I don't know, but it's... Like I said, when I went dur during murders at Carl of Manor, I bought like the fucking mad expensive, like 40 pound, like purely skit. And then I went and the event didn't fire twice so i bought the pre-release kit bit and couldn't even play and they were like oh here's some like prizes i guess but i was like what the hell yeah it's a bit ridiculous all right i think we just win the game here to be honest so we're gonna get like three pings oh my god this is a fantastic turn holy shit <laughs> oh this is great oh this is great look at that yup ob has a job Ob has a job. That was very satisfying. I'm going to keep it going. I'm, I'm not going to get this value many more opportunities like in life, you know? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what we had in mind. There you go. There you go.